Hi everyone, Joe at Truck Stop Card Shop, and as you saw, I did all the packaging, and I'm uh, I sped that way up just so that you wouldn't see. I'm going to go through the Fat Pack Extras. These are all the the basic lands that come with it, and this is the other little pack. It looks like it's all looks like uh, Piper the Swarm, nice foil rare, and it looks like you get a couple foil of each of the lands. All right, so that's that, and then you saw me open up. The Rowan, here's the little dice. You got the Rowan box. I'm looking for the giant killer. Just kind of give you an idea of what's all in here. Well, looks like this one doesn't have the of. I don't know, is that normal? Yeah, it looks like that's that's the new normal for going above the, the set. So I'm kind of just looking through here to find Anyway, let's let's see what that is. It's uh, uh, when Rowan Stalwarts enters the battlefield, you may search your library for a card named. Ro okay, so this is this is your your tutor for for Rowan up here. All right, so let's see if there's any other things that could be useless or useful. You never you never know what these. Oh, here's one. Garrison Griffin is a common. When it attacks, target knight you control gains flying until end of turn. That might not might not be too bad. You get four of those in this deck, and then Rowan's Battle Guard. As long as you control any Rowan Planeswalker, Rowan's Battle Guard gets plus three, plus zero. That, that actually might not be too bad. That's an uncommon. You get three of those. Some Windscarred Crags. Looks like a bunch of regular basic lands. And what do we got back here? Um, no, no, no specific artifacts that are only, you know, for this set. I'm just going to separate these and put these ones in here and put them in the Rowan box. If you didn't see that, that's pretty neat looking. That way I can keep them nice and safe while I'm doing this because I'm going to get these off to the side so I actually have room. Alright, so that's the Rowan box and the Oko one. Oko the Trickster, put two plus one plus one counters on up to one target creature you control. It's kind of expensive, for six six drop for four loyalty. Until end of turn, you become the copy of target creature, prevent all damage. And then the negative seven, until end of turn, each creature you control has base power and toughness of 10-10 and has trample. I mean, you're going to have a hard time getting that out and keeping it out. So, I mean, it's, it's okay. I mean, and then... Yep, here's the tutor for Oko. Yeah, let's see kind of what they got in here for the deck. And I, I play Arena, that's why you're not getting the codes for for this. So I'm, I'm keeping those. Because it gets me some of the cards in here for free. Uh, okay, so Oko's Accomplice. This is, okay, just got his name in it. It's a 3-drop for a 2-3 with flying, just a fairy. That's not too bad. Got four of those. And then... Ramble Fort Fink or Bramble Fort base power and top for, for 8 so it's a 2 drop to cast then 8 for the ability base power and toughness 10 10 until end of turn only activate this if you have an Oko Planeswalker uh, I mean maybe I don't know let's see what we got back here at the back anything good um Nope. No art. No artifacts. No deck specific stuff that you can't get anywhere else. So yeah, they, this one had most of them. They usually have a few, but like these two decks, each had basically one semi useful card that can be used in that you can only get in one of these decks. So I mean, I guess that's that. And then you saw the dice. So get that off of there. And now we're gonna kind of move these over this way a little bit more to try to make a little bit more room I don't know I don't need the scissors anymore I've got them all open so I should be able to just do that and get them out yeah I'm not going everyone's seen the commons and the uncommons so I'm doing the commons uncommons and then you're off Lord of Gathering that's our first rare and then uh, Swampy is our first foil then we got a regular land, and I don't know, can anyone see up here? I can't tell. I'll, I'll do it kind of like that.
Alrighty, let's get through these com oh, I gotta make sure I'm not off camera. Commons, uncommons. Ooh, again I got the Great Henge right off the bat. Nice for mythic number one. That's a good one. Ooh, what have we got here in the front? Some advertisement thing? Or oh, that was backwards. Huh. Weird. And we got Furboral Elder, got a Mountain, and a Token. Why are things backwards? That's weird. And I like that. I like that Hypnotic Sprite artwork. I'm probably going to keep that one. I mean, I, I sell most of the stuff I get. I keep some to play with. And Gadwick the Wizened. And that one's just nothing. It's just an advertisement, not even a token. What the heck, wizards? So in other words, what that has become is packaging material. So if you buy something from my store, there's a good chance that will be either in front of or behind the actual cards you bought. Because I am not above using that kind of stuff for free packaging material. We got Rankle, Master of Pranks. That's my second mythic. So how's everyone liking the set so far? I I, I think it's neat looking. I, I just don't know. Once upon a time, that's a good one. And another packaging material. I really wish I could understand why they do that. Okay, that one's actually a token. I'll put that up there. Yeah, we got a worthy knight for our rare. Commons and Ayara, first of Lockthwain. Mm. Yeah, sorry, I know it might be annoying, but I, I, I keep all the packages and this stuff out in. Then we got Castle Arvindale. I still haven't decided if I like the uh, packaging material. I don't know which ones in here were the ones from the fat pack and which ones are for so midnight clock I, I mean I really don't care I just want to get it all done one video open every single pack I like that picture that's cool looking impossible line oh I like that one too the college are familiar I, I forgot about that one the magic mirror third mythic and then we got a uh, spore cap spider is our second foil. Everyone's talking about increased foil drop rates, and I'm not really seeing it here. Dance of the Mance. But you never know. Maybe I just haven't gotten that far. Or maybe these were all from the fat pack and there were no foils in those. I don't know. Just hanging out here in good old, just north of Richmond, Virginia. Folio of Fancy. That's our rare. And, oh, on an adventure. I like that one. Oh, yeah, that's right. These are backwards. Yeah, Blacks and Intruders is a weird looking card. I know. I, I still like it, though. <laughs> Pinocchio one. I like that one, too. Then we got Piper of the Swarm and Joust, Uncommon Foil, and another On an Adventure. What else we got here? We got Ice Crag, Ir Iron Crag Pyromancer. Apparently I gotta learn how to read. We 
god. Opportunistic dragon. I like that land with the, the island with the well. That one's cool looking. I'm just going to start stacking these over here. Drown in the Lock. I heard that one's good. I haven't played with it yet. Castle Lock Swain. And I am on an adventure. Oh. <laughs> so the ones in the fat pack were the, were the normal way. And the ones in the booster box were backwards. And then we got Sorcerer's Spyglass. Yeah, that was great that that got reprinted. And so the ones that I have are all going to sit there for a while. Actually, I'm going to move these like that. That's alright though. This is about playing a game and having fun, and I have fun doing this. I like that beanstalk giant. That's a cool looking one. And then we got Bone Crusher Giant. And garbage. Man, it is hot here. Another beanstalk giant. And then which is vengeance? Yeah, I can tell by the way the packs are. They're all like messed up, and the fact that they're face four, they're not from the box. These these ones right here are from the the other thing. The these are the fat pack or the murderous rider. Nice plain foil. Or the planeswalker deck. That's what I was trying to say. Oh shoot, did I just really do that? I really did, and I'm wasting everybody's time, but that's okay. I don't want to have this all messed up later. Okay, so there we go. We got Brazen Borrower. Very rogue. And a Garak emblem. Why are these all, like, did I knock these all over or something? I don't know what I did. Oh, it's because I'm at an angle on here. In my truck. Yeah, I'm, I'm still in my truck. This makes it not the easiest thing in the world to do. And we got Embercleave. Nice. And we got a Mystical Dispute. About halfway done so far. Thundering Stroke. Yeah, that's just my reaper kicking in. Gotta keep that yogurt fresh. So it's vibrating the thing, sorry. Castle Lock Swain again. Dance of the Mance. Emery, Lurker of the Lock. And then Forever Young, nice beautiful foil. A garbage packaging card. And I haven't decided. You guys let me know. Leave a comment. If no one leaves a comment, I'm just going to say screw it. And Do you want me to keep opening up older stuff too? Because like, I'm opening up stuff either way. We got Robber of the Rich and Lock Lane Paladin Foil. I mean, I, I open them up anyway for my store because I open a lot of boxes. But do you want to keep seeing the older ones? Like I got a whole bunch of M20, I still, you know, Core 2020 I'm still going to open up. You guys want to see those videos or are you guys over it and just don't really care anymore? If you don't care, then yeah, I'm not going to waste my time. I'll just cut them all open, get it all done, and get them all up for sale. Oh, that's another one of the dumb ones. I don't understand why they would do that. Well, we're back to the booster box. Packs. 
Got a stone, stone some coil serpent. And some food. Anybody hungry? I done brought some food. We got Yorbo, Lord of Gumbrogurberg. And some more food. Everybody gets to eat today. We done got some food. Yeah, sorry, it's taking a while. Just the extra packs and I'm um, oh I like that one. The flax and true to the alternate border one. And then we got oh we got Hush bringing I love that artwork. That's one of my favorite artworks of the whole set. And then we got Love Struck Beast Foil. Beautiful. And we got a bear. The bear and the maiden fair. Ha ha ha. And then we got Murderous Rider. And we are almost done. We got one little stack left. And like I said, that's just because, you know, I had like a half a booster box from the other stuff. Then we got Sundering Stroke and Forever Young Foil. I think I got one of those already, didn't I? Yep. So I got two Forever Young Foils. All right. I must be Forever Younger-ish. Move these down here, put that up there. Get that up like that. And Castle Vantress. And a foil foresty. And a token. See now it's even more excited when you get a token because it's not just like, oh, advertising on both sides. Thank you, wizards, because I can use that. Ooh, we got Return of the Windspeaker, and I like this. Smitten Swordmaster. Look at that. That's beautiful. The, art, the artwork and the foiling. I love that. Get all, all this stuff opened up. Yeah, this, this stuff sat, sat at home for a while. I was, you know, up doing cranberries up north because couldn't really take it with. I was working too much. Well, that agricultural stuff keeps you busy. Doom foretold. That's our rare. And then we got a jousting dummy for our foil. Be cool to get an Oko, but yeah. Gilded goose. I don't see that happening. Got a black lace paragon, black lance paragon, <laughs> lace. What is wrong with me today? I don't know. Ooh, Fay of Wishes. That's pretty. I like that. Sworn Knight. And there goes the reefer shutting off on me. Alright. I was hoping to keep it under 20 minutes. I think I just might make it. Well, no, probably not. Oh, I got Gark. Nice. I mean, it's not the alternate art or nothing, but I don't really care. I still think it's cool. Love struck beast. Yeah, that's fine. Looked weird for me for a second. Prized griffin and on an adventure in a swamp. Yeah, sorry about the angle this time. The I had to set the camera a certain way to keep it from tipping over. All right, we got stolen by the fae. <laughs> Everything's tilting that way. No matter what I do, it just keeps going. And drown in the lock. And ooh, Witch's Vengeance Rare and the Circle of Loyalty Foil Mythic. Nice. Let's see what else I got in here. 
couple. Oh, I like that. I like that artwork. That's cool. Castle Embreath and Edge Wall Innkeeper for the next foil. Uncommon. Looks like we got three packs left, and then we're all done with a booster box and a half because of the Planeswalker deck and the Fat Pack. Just open it all at once. Ooh, Realm Cloaked Giant. Another Mythic and a Mistford River Turtle. Planes and Honored Adventure. And oh man, they're all gonna fall off. We are down to the last two packs. We got a Stone Coil Serpent. And a land and not even a token. See, why would they do that? It's the exact same. Uh, whatever. Why would you put the same advertisement on both sides? And for our last pack. Oh, ooh. <laughs> Man. I love my luck sometimes. I mean, it's, I know it's not the super fancy whatever one, but who cares? I got Oko, Thief of Crowns. That is a good looking card. I like the artwork. He looks cool. Just balancing that knife and all that, the way it sticks up out of the top of the border up there. Yeah, I like that. Anyway, then we got Fairy Vandal and a Swampy and a Wolf. And that's the end. Anyway, Joe at Truck Stop Card Shop. Later.